Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to package your project. I offer the option to simply uh, do a bunch of screen grabs using your favorite screen grab tool. Or you could even possibly do a, a walk around from workstation to workstation where students just play each other's games. That's another really easy option. Uh, but I will show how to package in case this is something you would want to do so that you can send it and uh, create an EXE file that could play on any other PC. So here you go. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to project settings and we're going to maybe rename it. Well, I've already named mine third person uh, environment showcase. Okay. And it's a very basic project, so this is, should be very easy. And I'm going to close this. And then under File, I'm going to click Package Project, Windows 64-bit. Now, if you have iOS, you probably would want to do that. Uh, there's other configurations, but for the way we built ours, it's pretty much PC or, or uh, iOS. And then what we want to do is send it somewhere. I'll just send it to its original folder, select folder. So it's going to package, it's going to take a few minutes. Uh, it's a very small project, shouldn't be too long. So I'll just pause it for a second. So it took about three minutes to package. So I'm going to actually turn on, so you see the exe file. Again, exe file runs on a PC. Uh, so I'll double click on that. You could export for a Mac as well, it would be the same thing. Uh, and I'm just going to play briefly just so you can see it'll have a higher quality than what you saw in the engine again I turn this off. I have VR headset. You wouldn't see that pop up. So Again, I did my level really quickly. So with your students, there would be a lot more uh, Going back and forth and see there are the collisions remember I hadn't added a collision here So see this was something I would uh, I would have fixed before and uh, So, you know all the jump features everything uh, is built in and works so there's that one of those trees it will just again I would have play tested this um, my goal with the lessons is just to give you a basic run up and look at how great this looks and I didn't actually add the collisions to this one but I would have taken time with the students to probably do that uh, my lake well I did put a material and the material does have a collision so I'll be able to run on the lake which is kind of funny uh, but students could go online and figure out how to make a transparent lake. There are ways to do it where they go in and, uh, you know, you can just keep building on to these things. That's the whole thing that's so wonderful about Unreal Engine. And again, this has a collision. So uh, there you go. You get a sense of the play test. And, uh, you know, it was a lot of fun to make this. And I'm pretty sure your students will enjoy it as well. And you can add way more. And the better you get, the better your levels will be. And the advantage of an EXE file is you could email this to your friends, family, they could play it, and they also can keep a copy of it, which is something pretty incredible. All right, thank you, and I hope you enjoy the series.